it's payback. Huh, so I'll take that. Ask them now, we'll say that. I've been going to the top and I got what they not, so I know that they hate that. Uh, but I'm on now. All these lanes gonna zone out. And all these lanes gonna take what I did and they switch and they worse till I fall out. Uh, but I know that, so I keep what I'm doing cause I own that. And I stay in the lab and I kill everything, but I don't ever move, I'm a code that. So what is going on, everyone? Welcome back to the vlog. Today we are in. Labatouche, as you all told me, is how it's pronounced. Whatever. Uh, we're on Bullock Link Track. Uh, we just let down some tires. It's just, well, it's Sam and Mitch's cars. And speaking of tires, they both have new setups. So let's go talk to them about it. Tires. Oh, yeah. What's going on? I love tires. They're my favorite things. All right, we'll go through. Let's go through your car first. Well, that is, that's the dream. The dream. The dream The dream wheel set. 35 sticky traps on bead locks. Yep. So, they came up second hand on Facebook and I was just like, have to have them. Yep, yeah, so second hand, well he, he didn't actually know if they were sticky traps, did he? He had no idea. Yeah, but they they feel like sticky traps. Yep, so. and I've got one odd rim, which I'm shattered about. Yeah. One, they're all neg 22s except for one that's like a I don't know, a neg 10 or whatever Pilux like is run. Neg 12. So that sucks. But we'll get that sorted and we'll be much better. Yep. But very keen to do some caterpillar tire bulging flexing <laughs> stuff. Cool. Yeah. Alright, so that's Sam's car and then Mitch also has a new setup. What's going on with your car? We got 34 inch <coughs> Maxxis Razors. Oh yeah. So on 17s. Our good mate Nathan at Treadworks helped me out with that. So on your Treadworks? Yeah, actually a good bloke. <laughs> Instead of buying from the other grumpy old bastard that we've always had to go through. So no, it's good. They seem alright so far. Obviously, I haven't done any four-wheel driving yet, but it'll be good to see how they go. And uh, yeah, made a set of spinners on them. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, and also got to give a shout out to my mechanic Luke at King Lake Automotive Services for uh, helping me out fixing the front end after I snapped an axle into Langley last weekend. So I sort of gave it to him last minute and he had a few dramas but coming on a Saturday and got it done for me. So went above and beyond. So thanks Luke, much appreciated. <laughs> Brilliant. Good bloke. Thanks for making today happen. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're gonna hit up yep. Bullock Link Track. It's a little bit moist. Uh, hasn't rained in the last week, but it's still a little bit wet here. So yeah, la last week it, it rained a lot. So hopefully it is wet. So we've just caught up to a few people. There's also some people behind us. So it's pretty busy today on this track. Yeah, they must be up looking at the track or something. Got a bit of rubber on the old rock. Well, that's dirt. But no, <laughs> I, no, I couldn't see what I was grabbing. There you go, that's a bit of rubber. Yeah. <laughs> that's all rubber. <laughs> all the way up the side of the rock. That's impressive. That's pretty thick rubber. That's impressive. Oh, well, now I got dirt all over me.
Want to do it? No. It's pretty slippery. Yeah. Worst comes to worst, just put a winch on. Yeah. Slippery means you can't break axles, isn't that right? Yeah. <laughs> no sudden stops. Yeah. <laughs> 
Straight back. I'm a really good one, Down, keep going, keep going. Come on, just start going hard that way. Yeah, right. Get in the bed too. Yeah, right. Oh, shit, now I'm in the back. Look at my go. Right hand down, or am I in the same spot you were? You're in the same spot I am now. Yeah. Job team. Nice. Boy Jack, come on. That jet like that one. Yeah, good. <laughs> oh, I'm the first car. <laughs> I didn't like it. <laughs> that was cool. Made it. it. Good job, Mitch. <laughs> well, just smashing things, just the bull bar. Your yeah. hook? Just the, the hook, hook on the recovery thing. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you're, like you're just like nicking the bull bar. Oh, yeah. And you spider saved the door thing. Yeah. Good job, thing. <laughs> Do you guys want to go? Yeah. 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 Anyway, thank yeah. you. Thanks, guys. Thanks for that. Thanks for that. Is there any hard hit uh, again? Yeah. <laughs> There's like a really steep downhill, like super steep downhill into like a bog hole. Uh -huh. And then there's like a, I don't know, it's like a, a gully. Like you don't really have a, you don't have a choice of where you go. It's like walls either side and pretty flexy yeah. and stuff. But that could all be different now because the, the, the run in was all different. Oh, okay. So, yeah. Right. But the, there, I reckon the bog holes will still be there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Have fun, guys. Yeah. See ya. Oh. Still, I rate the tyres. Yep. Poor line choices, though. No, oh, I wouldn't fucking miss. I was trying to set out the GoPro, but it wasn't working. I think all that is spotting, though. Yeah. Like it's not really, it's not, like it does have stuff to do with the driver, but it's got a lot to do with like the person outside spotting the car, getting the right line and getting them in the right spot. Oh, that was a treat. Yeah, it is important to have a good, good spotter who knows. The spotter is have. driving the car pretty much. Yeah. But I reckon considering the conditions, we got through that pretty good. No broken parts, but yeah. no. Yeah. I'm pretty happy about it. Mitch is Mitch will be happy about it soon. <laughs> Mitch was definitely a little bit a little bit tense after after driving that. Mitch is just a bit worried about pushing his car because they the may have found some um, teeth in his front diff, but it works so they don't know if it's broken or not. And last weekend he broke an axle and he doesn't want to break any more parts, which is fair enough. I don't think I explained it too well in the video, but those guys are in front of us let us through, which was really awesome. A um, bunch of good blokes, actually. Um, they're from SL 4x4 Club, which says for Sri Lankan 4x4 Club. I'll find it out if they have any like socials or anything, but um, no, they were cool. Anyway, we just got this next little bit. There's a few bog holes here, but they're like endless mud, so we're going to try this way that I'm walking through right now. Doesn't show up on video too well, but that section right there is really thin, so that's why we were kind of worried. But anyway, we just got to come down here, little step, and we'll be on our way. Would this be a good time to talk about shirts for a little bit? Oh, you, you're talking about him now? Yeah. Oh. Well, we can. He's got to drive down here first. <laughs> I thought you were talking on that. Or are no. you talking on that? I am talking. Oh. Recording. Well, we've got shirts now. <laughs> yeah, we've got shirts. Just 
as you can see. Just a bit dirty. A little bit of living four by four. And then there's, they've got jumpers. And then, yep. oh. Oh. Bloody Singlets. models. Singlets. Yep. Nice. All the same design except for two. You can get There's one with Sam's car on the back and one with my car on the back. Yeah. Um, I've got one with my car on the back. It's pretty mad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll get Mitch through. And then I'll tell you where you can pick them up if you want to. We kind of really just got shirts because we wanted shirts. So if you want to buy them, then they're for sale. Straight. Your back wheel's past the bad bit. But yeah, we kind of just made shirts because we wanted shirts, um, and then we we're like, well, we may as well make them for sale in case anyone wants wants to pick them up. Um, they're available on represent.com/slash living four by four. This just feels weird. That's mad. So yeah, there's bloody singlets, t-shirts, long sleeves, hoodies, jumpers, whatever you want, I suppose. There's also female singlets as well. I yeah, I, I just ticked all the boxes. <laughs> made, for made for Mitch Wilson. Yeah. And also, I saw on um, um, Instagram the other day, Razzler's doing their hoodies at the moment. Too. Oh, yeah. So, um, I if missed you want out to, last year, so yeah. hopefully I can get one this year. If you want a Razzler hoodie, just hit them up, I think is how it's working. you got to pre-buy them. Pre-order. Yeah, pre-order. Um, but yeah, if you buy our stuff, then that we get a little bit from that. I didn't mark it up too much, but yeah. that'll go towards the channel. It'll help out the channel massively. Yep. So... If you and feel plus like it, look fresh. <laughs> if you feel like it, you can. But help feel, help fix the broken axles. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Anyway, keep moving on. What's next? Is that it? There's like a hill farm gully. Flexi boy. Flexi boy. Wall boy. All the boys. But without big rocks, I don't think. Or is there rocks? There's one big rock, and you gotta like go straddle it. Oh, that's what I'm thinking. Yeah. That could give us dramas. Sick. Do that. Nope. Oh, oh, Jesus. Stunt it. <laughs> All right, so I didn't show it on video. We got this rock wall, drive up wall section. That's too much. Too much wall action. You're not even on the rock. Yeah, you're not even on the rock. Just bloody driving on the side walls. Oh, oh boy. <laughs> What's the fucking dial, Sam? <laughs> What's the dial? Look at this bloody. That's like your timer. <laughs> yeah, all up there is bloody Sam. Awesome. Get me a. Like I'm six foot four or something. <laughs> and that's like. That's high. That is high. I suppose that's why they put the, like the actual tread on the sidewalk. Yeah. So you can just... Where? Wow, I thought it would have dug in, but that just... Oh, that's a long way. Yeah. I am stoked with that. I am super, super stoked with that. <laughs> I reckon you'll actually do that, the same thing, a lot easier than what you think you will. Yeah, Yeah. With your front locker. I just kept going, like you probably don't have to go that high. Yeah. But I was just like, I'd prefer to be too high because I reckon if it just, it would slide in. Yeah. You just tell me where to go if you get any bright ideas. Okay. Engage side biters. Right. Push that button. It gets some um, more of an angle up there. 
Yep. More angle of the dangle. No, your tray was just in the wall the whole way. You wait till you see it up there then. <laughs> Walking behind his car, there's too much switch. Ugh. That was pretty cool though, just take taking out his wall with his tray. Alright, it's Mitch's turn to come up, and then I think after that, I think this track is pretty much done. From memory? We're up here a while ago, so can't really remember too much. Good boy. Good boy. Taking bloody souvenirs home. <laughs> God, I love wow, <laughs> work. <laughs> Down there, it's like a big ball. Collection. I made that heaps wider for you. Thanks, mate. <laughs> it's funny dirt, isn't it? Yeah. It's like heaps of tiny little rocks. It'd be better if this rim was wider. Yeah. I've got to sort that out. Yes. A bit of man going on there. I don't know what track this is, this is just like a linking track. So, right now we are on Robertson's Creek Fire Trail. Uh, we've done this track before. Sam's gonna try this section um, with his new tyres. Yeah, I think this is gonna be our last track for the day. But yeah, if you remember from last time, this is actually the main section and then that big rock just behind me is a bit easier, it's so grippy. Um, so it's mainly getting into these ruts and then getting out of these ruts and over these big holes if he decides to continue with it. But come on, he's got sticky traps. The man should be able to do anything.
gonna come down. Yep, yep. Off stop. A bit. Dude. He fell into the hole. Then, Wasn't meant to fall into the hole. And launched straight out of it. Big bouncy boy. I think so. I was getting out of the way. That's not average. Yeah, rear wheel just fell in. You said you weren't going to do that track again. Did I say that? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh well. Oh, they're better the first time. <laughs> did it faster the second time. Faster the second. Yeah, that's true. We did spend a lot longer there the first time. Mm. Whew. I get them in some slop and just see all the mud fly everywhere. <laughs> Almost as good as the razors. <laughs> yeah, you're frothing the razors, aren't you, Mitch? Yeah, they do well. I probably love them. Well, Especially on that rocky business. Yeah. Uh, I rate my razors in the mud and the rocks. Yeah, well, on that, that first air going bit, like, didn't seem to have much less or, yeah, or any less traction than Sam's car on the rock. Yeah. Or slippy rock. So I like them. Lovely. It's like driving on a driving on a big sponge. Yeah. Very spongy. <laughs> well, even the rubber's soft. Yeah. So that'd be bouncy. Pretty cool. You can like twist the rubber around. Yeah. So I'm Kane. Cool. Kane should get out and do some more. I reckon. <laughs> All right. So we're just gonna air up the tires and head off. Really. So that's the end of the day. Um, and actually, an early one for us. It is 3 p.m. 3.01 to be exact. Normally, we're getting home at like 7 p.m., 6, 7 p.m., so this is actually pretty early for us. But yeah, anyway, we tested out some new tyres. Yeah. Razors went well. The sticky traps went well, too. Um, but anyway, that is going to do it for today's video, so thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Catch you guys there.
Jeez. Well, that's mint. Toys, why don't you go to a plant, man? Uh, on trips. Hey, you got on. Plant, man, on trips. That's pretty cool. Oh, how's the plant then? Oh, bit of fire. Lovely. This plant burns though. So. It's all good. Making the world a better place. <laughs>